Hey, what's up guys, Austin here. So this is gonna be like a spur of the moment review video that I wasn't really planning on shooting, but I just recently got this drum tool, which is pretty awesome. And it's a, uh, it's a porthole cutter for the resonant head of the kick drum. And I've never had to use one of these before because I've just always bought heads that have the hole pre-cut for you. But I recently got a uh, fiber skin ambassador and I had to uh, cut this hole myself. This guy works pretty well for that. It's called the Bass Drum O's porthole cutter. You can get it on Amazon for like $10.24, I believe. So I'll have it linked below if you guys want to check it out. But yeah, I'm going to show you kind of like a close up of how it's designed and stuff. And then we'll cut a hole with it so you can see how it works. Okay, so this is what it looks like up close. So it's pretty simple. It's designed a lot like a compass would be if you wanted to like draw a circle on a sheet of paper. So you got this center point here that's really sharp and that's where you actually puncture the head and that anchors it to be the center of the circle. And then you just rotate this around to cut the hole. And it's got like a rolling blade uh, here on the end. That's pretty sharp. So yeah, you can remove this piece and that changes the, um, the width of the circle or the diameter of the circle. But if you uh, just want like a standard five inch hole, I put it on the uh, fourth slot and that worked pretty well. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's uh, cut a hole with it so we can see how it works. Okay, so I'm gonna demonstrate it on this head here. This is an older Remo Power Stroke 3 that I was about to throw out, but uh, I'll just use this for demonstration purposes. So I would recommend uh, laying it face first, so that way this is flat. If you do it like this, it's gonna have a lot of give in it, right? So put it like this, so it's on a flat surface. And then you basically just take this little point, wherever you want the center of the hole to be, press down pretty hard, and you'll feel it kind of click into place. And then you have to press down pretty hard on this too, until you hear it snap, that means it's in. And then you just go around in the circle, putting down pressure. And that's it. It's pretty clean, super clean circle. 10 seconds, no problem. So yeah, guys, check this out. Uh, Bass Drum O's porthole cutter. I'll have it linked below, but yeah, uh, super efficient little tool if you need to cut um, holes in your kick drum head. So check it out. 